Here's how the Cleveland Cavaliers became the hottest team in five minutes, and it all starts here. This offseason, the Cavs fired current Pistons head coach J.B. Bickerstaff and replaced him with none other than Kenny Atkinson. Kenny is somehow pretty unheard of around the NBA, so for those of you who aren't familiar, he is most known for two things. The man who coached the Nets team into the playoffs with literally no expectations, and for being Steve Kerr's right-hand man for about four years with some championship runs. Kenny has a very strict focus on player development, and defensive schemes which fit brilliantly with a team like Cleveland. A ton of potential with names like Evan Mobley, Darius Garland, Isaac Okoro, and Craig Porter Jr. Obviously, there's other guys like Donovan Mitchell and Jared Allen, and they can still learn a thing or two every day, but they are much farther along in their progression as they have made all NBA teams or all-star teams in their respective careers. Aside from the acquisition of Kenny, the story of unsung heroes is a big reason the Cavaliers are off to such a hot start. Ty Jerome has helped this team become more competitive and ways that you won't see unless you don't just watch the box score. And it's interesting because Ty had an excellent year in Golden State, but was not re-signed. The Cavs got an insanely good deal offering him a two-year, $5 million contract that he did accept, and he does all the little things you'd want your quality backup point guard to do. He plays good defense, he dives on loose balls, he shoots the hell out of the three ball, he's shooting 61%. It's only on two attempts, but you get the point I'm trying to make. Uh, he is great in transition, he's wonderful out of the pick and roll and other sets, DHO as well. Uh, with Sam Merle and Max Drews has been hurt, but with guys like that, it's very important to be that way, just good in sets, good off the ball. And I'm not sure how Golden State didn't you know, decide to keep them. And alongside Ty, other unsung heroes like Karis LeVert have been a lot more consistent this season and has paid off at big time. Karis has turned into a very efficient and smart passer as he's carrying a 5 to 1 assist to turnover ratio alongside Darius Garland. A big issue with Cleveland basketball last season was some shot selection. And I, I know Cavs fans know that I'm being a little nitpicky, but it's true with, with Donovan and Garland and nights where Donovan wasn't in and Evan Mobley, it just felt very different. And this season, it it feels a lot better. There's definitely a lot less settling in this offense, meaning we're not throwing grenades at each other and taking these terrible shots. With all that being said, there's still the fun moments with Garland and Mitchell. We saw last night in that Golden State game where a certain player is just taking over and we say, all right, let's just clear out and let him go to work. A player who deserves a ton of flowers in this Cleveland offense and defense is Evan Mobley. The power forward is averaging 18 points, eight rebounds, and two blocks a night while also shooting the ball from downtown. This is something that Cleveland fans have wanted for a long time if Evan can stretch the floor it opens it up a lot more for Jared Allen and there's a lot more minutes where we can see both of these guys share the front court outside of Evan six people are shooting over 40 percent from three with four shooting over 50 percent and might I add that Darius Garland is shooting 48 percent from three on nearly eight attempts a night this type of efficiency is unmatched and this type of energy is unmatched the city of Cleveland has done great showing out for the Cleveland Cavaliers just on the road and at home. While only 15 teams have started 10-0 in NBA history, I'm not going to be the guy who overreacts and says that they can win or they will win the championship. I do think the Cavs have made it clear that they are contenders. I pray that they stay healthy, but this is why the Cavs are the hottest team in basketball. New coaching, new energy, new bench pieces, an unsung hero stepping up behind the leaders of Darius, Donovan, Allen, and Mobley. If you made it this far, thanks so much for your guys' support. Let me know if you are rocking with the Cavs down below. I appreciate our support as always. Have a great rest of your day. Stay happy, healthy, and blessed. Peace.